what I found here is, is the back footprint of a, a large armored dinosaur called a nodosaur. They're called a nodosaur because they had big nodes and sometimes real pointed items, protective items across their back and even sometimes up on their shoulders and, and sometimes even by the side of the head. This is really quite a rare find. Notice our tracks are, are, are not often found. There are some out west and up in British Columbia in Canada, but uh, we don't have a whole lot of them in the U.S. And uh, this is one of the few that I have found right here in Maryland in the eastern United States. The hematite uh, it can be red, it can be dark colored, or when it gets water into it, it's called limonite. It can be yellow and gold. And uh, according to other people doing track work, Maryland's tracks are the most beautiful dinosaur tracks color-wise that have ever been found anywhere in the world. The th most thrilling thing about finding this one, I found other Notosaur tracks, but what really thrilled me about this one was because I found it at Goddard Space Flight Center, and I love the paradox. Here, space scientists may walk along here, and they're walking exactly where this big, bungling, heavy, armored dinosaur walked maybe 110, 112 million years ago. I, I feel like what we need, all of us need to be aware of preserving this wonderful past of this beautiful blue planet of ours. I mean, if we don't preserve it and if we don't look down and spot these things, they could be torn up by machinery and so on. So I ask people to consider themselves custodians, do the right thing, notify someone at a museum, someone that would know and can help and see that it contributes to scientific knowledge if it has that capability.